Hello, my friends, and welcome to something new. Today we're playing Rius 2, the sequel to Rius, of course, a god game that came out in 2013. I think it's like a god, it's like a god simulator. You play as nature and you've got these giants. You know what? This will all make sense. We're going to choose a human spirit that will seed the destiny of this new planet. We will choose a random character. And what can I do here? I can... Is this choosing which one I want or which one I don't want? Difficulty. Giant. Sure, we'll just... Is that the recommended one? If you want a real challenge meeting humanity's goals, it's balanced around this difficulty. Fine. I don't know what it wants me to do here. They're all checked, so I'm just gonna... Whatever. The final era will be the ancient era. And the play mode is... Sure, we'll play challenge. We'll do tutorial quests, of course, because we need to learn how to play this game. Let's just jump in stop talking. Oh, look at our little dudes. A new era dawns. In Rias 2, every era starts with a barren planet. It's up to you to create a livable habitat for the humans. Your goal is to explore all fates of humanity by completing eras. Each era has its own set of goals. Goals you achieve. The more goals you achieve, the faster you'll unlock new content and mechanics. Wonderful. So before we pick an era, we have to follow a planet's prologue. This is the tutorial. Click question mark buttons to gain more info. Okay, first step. Settle a city. We need to select terraform planet, create biome, and then select an area for the biome, and then click a nomad and tell them to start settling. So we need to find which buttons terraform. Terraform planet. Create forest. Move the mouse to drag a range. Sure. Doesn't say how much we should make. But here comes this forest giant. Yeah, it doesn't say. And then we click the nomad. Which is this. You have no nomad charges to call a nomad. Well, that sounds like a problem. What does this do? Choose a location for these nomads to settle. Right here in the middle. Alright, spend five... Eons to place a bioticum. How do I do that? Biotica are animals, plants, and... Minerals. Giants can place. Cities collect resources from them. Creating new bioticum uses five eon. Okay, so we want to select animal, plant, or mineral. Oh, that's what these giants can do, I think. Oops. And then place it. Okay. So if I click this guy and then I click here. Nope. Create plant. Bam. Nope. I did it wrong. Create blueberries. There we go. Now we're doing things. And then I can switch to a different giant and say... Let there be rabbits. Oh, that's outside of the city's territory. That sounds unhelpful. Activate a symbiosis on a bioticum. Oh, okay. That's a lot of examples. Complete the city's request. What is the city's request? Inventor settlement. Have three technology. Okay, we'll get there eventually. So apparently there's some kind of... So what is this? Critter herbivore fur. But if I put a mossy stone here, what does that do? I don't understand the symbiosis or whatever. The stout needs a critter like the rabbit. I didn't even see a stout. Is that an animal? The stout. Yeah, there we go. Oh, okay. Oh, let's replace these mossy stones with stouts. And these should symbio some symbiotically exist together. Yeah, look, see? It's green. How am I supposed to know that, though? Oh, I see. They get plus 20 if adjacent to one other critter. Okay. Oh, I can move those giants separately. That's cool. If adjacent to a plant... Oh, okay. So if I put this here, it's going to be happy about living near this tree. Yes. Look, see? Green synergy. Oh, and these berries want to be near a mineral. So if I put a mineral here, which is none of these. Oh, here we go. Which of these are minerals? I don't know how to tell. That's a gem. Is What's a gem? What's a mineral? This quartz. Quartz is an element. Is any rock a mineral? Desert minerals. Oh yes, these are all minerals. Okay. Oh, so this is actually gonna... This is gonna sim symbiotically work both ways. Look, see? The time has come for a new era. But we haven't settled their request, but okay. The calm era. Humanity advance, advances to the next era, but not with a particular inspiration or goal in mind. An opportunity for you to focus on improving their pro prosperity. Help uh, humanity settle at your own pace. Have 30 diamonds on the planet, whatever those are. 
Oh, these are... Okay, there's three quests in the area. In the era, I understand. Or we can change. We don't have to pick Calm Era, but I think that's the only one we have available. Alright, I confirm. The first era, the Calm Era. The Calm Era is here. Inventions are inspired by Biotica within borders when cities have enough technology. Okay. They grant the city stats directly and can be traded with neighboring villages. There will never be duplicate luxuries on the planet. I understand. Rias 2 has a lot of mechanics and nuances to learn. It would be impossible to learn them all at once. Fair enough. Learn them at your own pace. That's my goal. Almost everything has a tooltip explaining it. Yeah, I've noticed that and I'm very grateful for it. Alright, we want 30... Is that people? That must be people. We want 30 people on the planet. So I think we're going to need to expand or terraform. Then we can add desert here. And then can we add ocean on the other side? No. But we can start doing things over here in the desert, right? Oh, could we call a nomad over here? I have no charges to call a nomad. Never mind. Can I expand something interesting over here? Create adjacent to a mineral. So we could put this here. And that will be happy. And then over here, what could we put next to that mineral? Uh, maybe we just need more animals. Put the stoat. And we'll put a couple rabbits down. So the stoat's gonna go there. And then we'll put down a couple eons. Or a couple of rabbits. They cost eons. Oh look. The more eons we get or spend, the more calm settlements we complete. Yeah, there we go. So this is now a calm... This is a complete calm settlement. Is that right? Am I understanding this game correctly? Who knows? The planet's not huge. I'll say that. Now we might need to... Oh, the time has come to conclude this planet. Really? Okay. Complete a planet. Okay. Prosperity. We got some. That's what the diamond is. It's also people. Alright, we got nothing. No rewards. Zero rewards. So we can continue playing or we can leave the planet. I guess I leave the planet because it said we were done here. Conclude the planet. The journey of discovering nature and humanity has just started. Great. Swamp giant. I can bring my swamp giant as a plant guardian. Sick. The rainforest biome is now available. Or will be when we get to profile level 2. Okay. Sure. Oh, so this planet just sits here now and exists, and we can revisit it if we want, but it's considered complete. Okay, that's cool. It's got a fun name. Choose a human spirit that will seed the destiny of this planet, so I can just pick any of these. So we've already done one as the inventor. Let's do one as the sage, because food looked like it was easier. And then... Oh, no, we don't want to swap any of these guys out, do we? What have I done? Oh, no. There we go. Alright, we'll do the same thing again and see what happens. And we'll do the tutorial quests, but we'll skip through them quickly if it makes sense. Every era begins with the barren planet. And what am I missing here? Because we're just doing the same thing again. Settle a city. Oh, that's not ready. Okay. Oh, we can start off with something different this time. Oh no, those are plants. Hang on. Terraform. Create forest. Okay, we'll just start off with a normal forest then. Oh, this is how you create the ocean. I have to wait until that giant's done terraforming. Anyway, let's call our nomads here and get this started over here. Alright, we want to build bioticums. Nope, oh, there was a bunch of stuff showing up very briefly. I guess it shows everything. Alright, place these minerals here. And then I think this wants to be near minerals. It means we can put more minerals nearby. And then on this side, I guess we'll do the same thing again with the stoats and the rabbits. Oh, am I waiting for him to get over here? I guess he was busy making the oceans. We did it. Complete the city's request. Have a population of three. We're doing it. It's happening. So what did I build? There's the rabbits. I need to build the stoats. Did something bad happen over here? Yeah, we never got our thing built. Oh wait, yes we did. Oh see, I can settle a new city with these nomads. 
Oh, interesting. I don't want to do that yet. The time has come for a new era. Has it? Okay. Have at least two cities with three population. Oh, I don't want to... Okay, we'll do that. I don't understand. We'll try not to conclude early then. Where's my planet? Why am I seeing this? Hello? Did I break the game already? Uh-oh. I can see it behind the... Quick save, quick load. I fixed it. <laughs> hey, let's set up a desert. I think that sounds cool. Who makes the desert? This guy. Nope, oh, we don't have that much room for it, but we'll do what we can. It's mostly ocean and forest. <laughs> so if I call a nomad a resourceful nomad, and I say, come and settle on the coast. Now they want three wealth. I don't know how to give them wealth, but... Let's see, can we put in desert animals? Okay, so these guys are going to want... Okay, let's put down some critters there. We can take our dude a little bit to get here. Our giant. Who knows how long it's going to take this nomad to get here. Here they come. Let there be life. So those are sand cats. And then what I want to do is put these jerboas near the sand cats. Because they'll make the sand cats happy. There we go. The city's ready. The port. What do they want? You can control a bigger area. Oh, sick. Draft an apex biotic'em. Use your draft charge to initiate a draft in the top of your screen. Go through the draft process to unlock the Apex Bioticum. Uh, select a biome. Sure, let's draft the desert. And then we'll unlock... What do we want? Limestone? Sure. <laughs> I don't understand, but okay. Oh, minus 25 for each adjacent mineral. So this one wants to be not near minerals. Not enough biodiversity to place limestone. Add more distinct biotica. Okay. But not limestone. Or not, not minerals. We don't want touching minerals. Maybe a snake. Because I want to put that limestone down in the middle here. Not next to any... Oh, it's iconic. We go. It's created a burrow and a micro haven. Oh my gosh, what's going on? Help us. They want 10 population at the Sage Village. These guys want three wealth. All right, I'm working on it. So what can I do to help you guys? You want to start a new project. Where should you look? You should make the farm. Eureka. Oh, so be it. I don't want to do that. I changed my mind. But, these snakes, they want to be close to other critters. But also another predator. That's themselves, right? Is that right? We put a sand cat in here. Does that make them happy? Small predator. Competitive. There we go. Everybody's hunting everybody. Now, we could start another village. This diplomat wants prosperity for all. Okay. So we'll call them over here. See, I don't want to conclude this planet. Or do I? Nah, we're gonna go a little bit longer here. Look, we could probably even put things in the ocean to make the ocean more interesting. So if we had fish... So this guy wants to be close to sea anemone or whatever that is. Oh, we don't have eons. Oh, we're out of eons. So do we have to conclude the planet? Is that how this works? And then... We're just slowly getting more resources? Yeah, I don't know. If I'm being honest, I'm a little bit confused. I guess we conclude. I guess it wants us to conclude, right? Planet complete. Okay. We completed this, the Calm Arrow with one star. Oh, look at that. We get an Apex Bioticum unlock as a reward. So it seems like each planet that we complete, we unlock a little bit more to work with. Ooh, pearls. That's cool. Don't know what to do with those. Guess we'll say goodbye to this planet. Okay, so we've unlocked bringing the Swamp Giant as a plant guardian. Oh, and this. Ah, we can now advance to the second era. See? It takes time. Now, does that mean that I can't go back to these old planets? If I hit revisit, I'm just curious. Is it still concluded? Yeah, I think it's just... So if I go to continue playing free mode on limited Aeon, I don't want to do that. 
How do I get out of here? Leave planet. I want to keep focused on building new planets, even though I have no idea what I'm doing. Choose a human spirit. The goddess. And this time we'll bring our swamp giant. Why not? <laughs> ah, look, we have another era that we can end in. The medieval era. Bro oh, I left tutorial quests on. You know what? I don't want that. Please. Can I? I don't, I don't want the tutorials on. I meant to turn it off. <laughs> Alright, I'll just click through them. It's fine, don't worry about it. I know what I'm doing now-ish. This time we start off with a rainforest. Honestly, I should have started with them bordering over there. That's okay. This is a mineral booster. We did it! We've completed their request. See, I wanted to get a desert biome going this time. But we had it last time. Not necessarily a port. Somebody... The Pirate Queen. Yeah, we'll put you kind of near the border here. Why not? So now we're just waiting. Hey, we get to draft an Apex Bioticum. Let's do something in the rainforest. Sure, do the bio booster. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just kind of winging it here. This thing wants to be adjacent to a tree. So it shall be. Is that the right one? Oh, this one wants to be adjacent to an animal. So if we put this here... And then we put an animal... Over here... This is, oh, we're out of eons. Okay. It's time for a new era. Fair enough. Uh, place a bioticum to give them resources. Oh, how do I do that? I forget. Wait. No, an apex bioticum is what I thought that meant, but it isn't. The Iron Age. Ooh, look at this. The Monument Age. Let's go Iron Age this time. We're experiencing new ages. This is just the tool tips. Tips. How about a new biome? I feel like we should have an ocean. So we need 10 technology on the planet. We've got enough minerals. We just need more technology. Oh, we don't have any other desert plants this time. Just the sagebrush. Oh, but we could build the gumbo lumbo. And then while we're here, let's get some fish. Actually, we can build this sea anemone mimi anemone. Oh, we don't have any... Oh, we do have a yawn. What am I talking about? Inspire a project. Hello. I can build you- I can give you more gem bioticas. Eureka. So be it. I bonus Eon at the planet shop. I don't even know what that means. Here we go. So what can we do? We can trade these? Ah, yes. I don't know if we want these numbers to be low. Is that okay? I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. Now we've got these two drafts up here, too. So let's draft for the desert. And maybe this time we'll go for Lapis Lazuli. Why not? And you know what? We can have a merchant on the coast. Nope, too close. There we go. That's another desert port. Why not? Spend all your Eon and complete the planet. Okay, we'll do our best. Where does this go? It can go anywhere. Look at the people. They're like, birds. We love birds. Don't think... Just threw a spear and turned into a stake. Mm, bird. Another draft? For the ocean? No. How about one more for the rainforest? Let's unlock hemp. Why not? I don't know what this button means. Upgrade slots. Something about charging abilities. This is all very overwhelming the, the more we get going. Hemp needs a level 2 slot. What does that mean? How do I upgrade the slots? <laughs> I don't understand. Whatever, we'll put in this Ramon tree. This is a level 2 town? Is that what that means? 
Oh, these guys want a project. How about you build? You need more predators in the biome. We can do that. Eureka. So be it. Oh, actually, I don't know if I can. Ah, this is a predator. Does this count if it's the same predator twice? Here we go, an iron mine. The time has come for a new era. Yay, one star. Fantastic, we did so good. Let's go to the era of... Castles and Knights, why not? Each leader builds a unique castle, that's cool. Look, the planet's getting bigger. Ooh, a new project. Yeah, you know what? We're, we can get you two more minerals within your borders. So be it. Let's see. We've put everything that your borders can hold. I suppose we could replace maybe some of these trees or something, or birds. Why don't we just put, we can put some down there. Of course, it's taken this guy a while to get around. <laughs> And then, do we have any more projects that people need done? I suppose we could put some things over here. Do we have plants for the desert? We don't. But, there's tons of minerals. Oh, these guys are all working together now. That's the prosperity with our pirate queen. Have more wealth than the pirate queen. Oh, jeez, this is so hard. Now I have to balance these kind of things. Okay, that's a little bit of thought process that needs to go into this. Wait, so I just need to put more wealth here. Let's get an ocean draft. More fish, maybe? Or more... How about pearls? Let's deal with pearls here. Look at the wealth that's come down here. Is this not the Pirate Queen's Village? Yes, it is. But if we put that there, then we can put some animals out here, too. Does it look like I have some idea of what I'm doing? Because I don't. A new project. Let's do the trade post since you're a port. That would be fun. Even though I don't really understand how to make it happen. <laughs> so what did I put in here? Sea crates. Oh, we want these adjacent to the coast. Okay, let's do that. Don't put the sea anemone me. Anemone. Sea. Anemone. Oops, did I cancel it? I wanted that there. Oh, look, these guys are trading across the oceans. And now we're going to put pearls there. New draft. Let's get an ocean draft. Let's get the marlin. I don't know if I'm going to be able to build it. We can put these down, too. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just making a mess. Another project? I don't know if I can satisfy any of these, but sure, we'll try. Oh, made the world a little bit bigger. We have a hundred prosperity on this planet. Look at that. This is such a prosperous planet. What are all these notifications? Sure, I've read them all. <laughs> I don't know what they mean. Oh, wait a minute. I can put down an iguana. Let's put it there. Let's replace this tree. The Ramon tree. Even though it might be doing something good. I want something new. There we go. A micro haven has been created. Are these filled? No, these are empty. So let's give them... But another iron mine right there. Oh, this one actually isn't empty. Look at our little planet. So this is a level 3 city. This one's only level 1. This one's level two. I don't know why. <laughs> this one's got all these mines and stuff. Well, this is a mineral boosted spot. Let's put Lapis Lazuli down. Why not? Is that going to finish this? Is that all the eons that we have? We apparently have three. Oh wait, we can buy more. Is that a good thing? Do we want to do that? The ocean. Oh, we can put good things down here in the oceans. 
there's already something there. Oh wait, here's the upgrade slots. Oh, we can place two Star Biotic on an upgraded slot. So if I did this... Can I do this? Can I do multiple? Sure, let's do it over here and see what happens. I don't understand this. Oh, I see. We store... The Biotica gets stored. And then we can put more things down. This is complicated. Let's put down more of these birds. And I think that ends it for us. That's it. It is time to conclude this planet. Progress was made, though. Look at that. We got zero stars in castles and knights. But look at how much prosperity we got. <laughs> what was our final score? Massive. Massive number. 126. I think that's big. That was big so far for me. We received a reward. A random apex biodicum for the forest. The antimony. Oh, gives us an output of 10 shells. And then we can discover tin and white. I don't really understand how any of this... Honestly, I've winged it for this entire video. But <laughs> we made three planets today. That's pretty cool, right? Look at that. We're level four. We're level five, actually. Look at that. Oh, new main spirits for our planet. That's cool. That's very cool. So look at that. We got a little solar system. We've got three functioning planets. This one here, we never even finished. That's fine. Didn't know what I was doing on the first planet, but look at that. So if you enjoyed this, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Leave a like on this video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think of Rius 2. Reus? Reus? How do you pronounce it? Doesn't matter. Reus? Reus? I think it's Reus. Reus? Reus 2. That sounds right to me. Alright. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the game. And of course, if you're new here and you enjoy these kind of videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on the bell for notifications. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope I see you again next time. Goodbye for now.